Hello everyone, welcome to today's class and our title today is Rough Jamboree. Let's start with the warm-up questions. Ilbon, have you ever participated in scouting? Scouting a tamyo hair bonjogi in Nayo? No, I haven't. Um I used to take part in a lot of outdoor activities, but scouting wasn't one of them. Uh where I lived though, basically, I learned a lot of things that scouts learn because I lived in the countryside when I was a young boy and my father and the people who I just hung around with, they would teach me how to make a fire, they would teach me how to cut down trees, they would teach me how to um, camp, uh, which is actually our next question, Ibon. Do you like camping? Camping gaanun go joa haseyo? Yes, I love camping. Um, I feel like I've been asked this question before, uh, but yes, camping is one of my favorite things to do in my spare time. The problem is I haven't done it for a very, 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 very long time. But when I was a child, uh, yeah, that's how far back I haven't done it. I used to go camping almost every weekend with my friends, uh, even if it was just in the backyard. But at my friend's house, he had a very big uh, property. And it was in the middle of, you know, deep, uh, I wouldn't say forest, but like the countryside. And so we would go camping there quite often. So I miss doing things like that. It was very fun. All right, now let's look at the vocabulary and repeat after me. Ilbon. Reclamation. 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 Kanjo. Uh... Semangum is a piece of land created by a reclamation project. So creating land in areas that were underwater. Ibon. Estuary. 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 Hagu. Hachoni padana hosuru hulioduro kanen bubun. So before the project, the area was an estuary that served as an important feeding ground for migrating birds. So it's a coastal marshland where river mix, uh, where river water mixes with the sea water. Sambon, festive, festive, festive. Chukje, on this dry land, which had actually been experiencing flooding, the jamboree had a festive start. Having a party-like atmosphere. Sabon. Mount. 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 Jungada. In the days that followed, however, complaints began to mount. Increase, gather up, or pile up. Obon. Last straw. Last straw. Last straw. Majimak Gyolchongta. So the approach of Typhoon Kanun was the last straw, and the remaining scouts relocated in the days that followed. So this is an idiom that means uh, the final thing that cannot be tolerated. Uh, it's there's another expression as well. Uh, it is nail in the coffin. Um, you actually, I will say this quickly. It the last straw uh, is also similar to. The straw that broke the camel's back. It's the same meaning. Last straw as well, and nail in the coffin. Actually, to be honest with you, this probably comes from this uh, idiom, all right? Because they're basically the same meaning. All right, uh, yukbon. Salvage. 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 Chikida or Huebokada. It's good that the scouts were able to salvage their trips, but now there are going to be some hard questions about why things were so went so poorly at Semangum. Uh, so salvage is to save something from being totally wasted or ruined. Alright, that was the preview section. Now let's move on to the review section.